Between 1989 and 2007, the Syracuse women's basketball team had a total of one NCAA tournament appearance. As recently as the 2006-07 season, the Lady Orange finished 9-20, but last year Syracuse broke out in a big way making the dance and ending the year with a 22-9 record. It was the pinnacle of a climb that began in the fall of 2006 when current SU head coach Quentin Hillsman was promoted to the position and brought an easy to understand approach to building a winning program. I think the recruiting is the most important thing. I think that for you to win at this level, you have to have great players. And the first thing that I, that I really wanted them to do was to go out and assign the best players possible. And Coach Q has definitely been able to do that. Syracuse's last two recruiting classes have been ranked in the top 15 in the nation, and while playing in the largest on-campus basketball facility in the country certainly helps Q recruit, his players say his honesty is also a draw. When he talks about his program, he, he just is real honest, and you know, he told me he told me the truth about what what I should expect. You know, he didn't try to make it some fairy tale story or anything. You know, he basically just said. We're going to have some good days, we're going to have some bad days, but in the end, we're going to be successful. That success appears to be set for even greater heights in the future. In the fall of 2009, a brand new basketball practice facility called the Mellow Center is set to open on SU's campus. The facility will give the women's team its own state-of-the-art courts and training equipment and give Coach Q yet another recruiting tool. You have your own place, you know, you have a home, so it's, it's going to be a tremendous, it's going to be a first class place, I mean, it's going to be plush, I mean, we're looking forward to it. Syracuse is Syracuse, you know, you got the Dome, you got Jim Beheim, you know, you got the men's team, Carmelo, but to take that next step in as far as recruiting for girls basketball, I think that the Mellow Center will help us. So the future is looking pretty bright for the Orange, but what about the present? Syracuse is coming off of a 78-71 loss to Ohio State here in Columbus, Ohio, and sits at 2-1 and one on the season. Up next, the Cuse will be back home in the Carrier Dome on Saturday to tip off against Portland State. Reporting from Value City Arena, I'm Gary Orr for Palestra.net, the College Network.